Hi, it's Player Ban! Hey everyone, it is time to continue the Rusty Lake series. I've got Rusty Lake Roots for us to play today. So a while back, I played Rusty Lake Hotel, and that was a pretty darn fun and challenging game. It had a lot of, a lot of puzzles, and um, they definitely made you think. Especially the math ones, but you know, it's math. And I'm really hoping that we'll be able to uh, see some more fun, challenging, and doable puzzles in this game. As you can see here, the art style definitely, definitely changed. It's almost like a, uh, what is that, color pencil kind of style. Uh, definitely more traditional art style than the uh, previous game, so that's pretty darn cool. So yeah, let's get started and see what puzzles await us. Rusty Lake, Spring, 1860. James Vanderboom arrived at Rusty Lake. His uncle had just passed away under mysterious circumstances. James was his uncle's only heir. He had no idea of the events that would change his life. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, I missed his first name already. Who is James? This is James. Hello, James. Seems to be something in your pocket. Oh, okay. Th th that's just some uh, dust in the air. What, what, is that <laughs> what is that letter, James? Ahem. <clears throat> Dear James, I regret to inform you that your uncle has passed away. He has left you his house in a very special seed. Plant it and start your own family. 572. Is that a hint to a puzzle? Maybe, maybe not. Okay, so they gave him a seed. All right. Like to start a farm or what are we talking about here? Ah, yes. <laughs> James is thinking about plants. I would too if I saw the word seed. Anything else in your pocket? Okay. All right. So you have a very nice suitcase here, James. Ah, but now there are three numbers that we need, which I'm guessing is what was written on that letter. What was it? 572? Aha. Yes, indeed. Ah, bone. James, that is really disturbing. Why is there a bone in your suitcase? What type of bone is that? What is this? Oh, yes, the seed. It's put in a very nice box. Okay, well, that was a creepy suitcase. All right, I guess it's time to check out this well, because we all know that good stuff. In movies, in games, come from wells. Looks like we need to attach something on this this thing. Oh, okay. Right, we gotta pull something up. Maybe we must feed... Oh, can I... It's like a different... Uh... I can't drag it. Okay. So, let me try to... I guess we gotta come back with a bucket. Alright. Anything else around here we can check out? Oh, we can... Oh my goodness! Who is this little guy? <gasps> Oh my goodness. This bone was for this doggy this entire time. Oh. You gonna. You gonna. Oh. Alright. There we go. We started the Vander Boom family tree. With the help of little Skippy over here and his bone. I was not expecting that, but I guess we got a watering can. Got a water seed. Oh, but there's no water in it. Ah, yes. Back to the well. Okay, is that is that good enough? Oh no! Oh no! Okay, we're we're really double dipping here. Got some extra water. <laughs> Can with water. Alright, James, time to water your family seed here, bud. Ah, yes. Man, that is the fastest growing plant I have ever seen. Okay. Is that is that it? Can we just poke it? Oh. Oh, James is also fascinated. 
Wait a second. So we did need to, or was it just you just need to tap the plant two times? James, are you surprised as I am? I will take that as a yes. Okay, so start it out with James here. Spring, 1860. The house. That is a very nice house. Alright, so James, you seem to be pointing at this bird nest above your head. But you can't reach it! There must be something that we must do to help you. Okay, well here's the beautiful family tree. Oh, I thought it was just like, we're just shaking the tree's hand, but I guess we just ripped off its branch. It was dying anyways! Here you go, James. Take this twig. Can you reach now? Okay, James, grow some longer arms, will you? Oh, a, d a diamond? Who on earth misplaced a diamond in a flower pot? Dang, James is lucky. And I guess he also picked up this worm and threw it in his pocket. Man, that is lucky. If I ever saw a diamond in a flower pot, I don't even know. There you go, James. Can you reach it now, bud? There you go, James. Pick up your nest with this black egg with white dots. Or is it a white egg that's covered in a black pattern? Oh no, I don't want to break it. Wait, or is it hatching? Oh, hello. Oh, dang. I <laughs> I just like had the worm already clicked on. I guess I guess we okay. A another diamond. Wow. Wow, James. This is 1860s were were years of miracles here. Okay. Um oh, I see. So we need 3 diamonds, eh? Then what is this right here? This bird reminds me of a character in the previous game. Very cool. Sorry we broke your window there, James. I hope you don't mind. Okay, is there a way that we are supposed to know the order at which we place these uh, diamonds, or does it not matter? Okay, well, let's just let's just take a guess. Take a gander. Ah, that was easy. <laughs> James was just locked out of his house this entire time. Poor James. Alright. Okay. Summer, 1860. The uncle. Alright. What do we got here? Um... Okay, we we got some bloody hands on here, but uh, is that blood or is that just some red paint? <laughs> oh, okay, shouldn't be doing that, but let's remember that it was a 6x3 grid of some sort. We got this jar of stale water. James, don't drink that. Oh, the Vanda... Vanda... Boom... Loom... I actually don't remember. Is that a B or now? Vanderloom Brothers. Yes, very nice. And what is this? What on earth? What? What does that say? Some pit core? You need a foot. A swirly thing. An, or intestines maybe? An eyeball? Some fingernails? A tear? Another eyeball, a large um, fingernail, a brain. And I'm not sure what that is, but maybe that's a big toenail. And, oh, and a key. Yes, all right. So do I need to collect nine body parts plus a heart body part? So 10 in all? All right. Well, this needs to be opened. Is this key? Nope, okay. Let's take a look at this clock here. Can we look at the time? It is currently 
12 o'clock. But is it midnight or is it noon? Okay, guess we can't open this. Nothing here. All right. So let's continue on. Ah, oh, there's James sitting by his very stained wallpaper. What are you thinking about, James? Thinking about starting a fire. All right, well, I'll help you out. We're going to get some wood, some flint going on there. Do, 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 do. Okay, well, got this hatchet. Got the matches. Of course, a classic Rusty Lake item to be used. Oh no, but I don't want to cut down the family tree. But we need some... Oh, there's some wood right here. <laughs> nice. Okay, am I playing as James? Who am I playing as? Because I am pretty darn good at chopping wood. Alright, let's start this. Ooh, there's a key hidden there all along. Aww. He's thinking of his wife or girlfriend or girl. Just someone he someone he uh admires. Alright, let's open this up. <laughs> Let's just uh, open this window for some fresh air here. <laughs> Don't mind the bloody, <laughs> bloody handprints on the window there. Oh, 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 here it is. A six by three. So what is that? One here, one here, one here. Let's see if I can actually remember that. Nice. I don't know what that means. Okay, so 825. All right, guess who just likes 825. Okay, I have to admit the puzzles so far in this game, not bad. Much easier than what I remember Rusty Lake Hotel being. I guess we just started the game, so it's nah. We're not that far yet. All right. What happened? Anything happen with that? Oh, maybe this opens? <laughs> uh, James, um, I think your, <laughs> your uncle was just sleeping in here. Uncle? Uncle, where are your pants? Oh, no, it's good. <laughs> That's not how you wake him up. Is he holding something? Uncle. Goodness gracious, get yourself together, man. James, <laughs> your uncle is on the ground behind you. He's just, he's just dreaming. All right, so... I... This is, this is weird. Um... What, what are we supposed to be- Oh, we're supposed to wake him up? This jar of water? Do I cut this rope? I can't do anything. This jar of water. Is there anything over here? Hmm. Oh, no. Oh, dear. This was- I do have to use the hatchet. <laughs> Why? Why is the first thing we see an enlarged man's nipple? Goodness gracious. Oh, there's an arrow that's just pointing right <laughs> You start right at the nips. Oh, goodness gracious, I just got a achievement. We just opened the nipple gate. I don't want to go in here. I want to close this nipple gate. <laughs> so ridiculous, I was not expecting this. So what is this line here? I guess we just knock knock. Uh, all right, well, there's the heart. Oh, we're traveling through his body. Are we on, like on the magic school bus? How are we doing this? I guess we gotta grab a tooth. 
Oh, sorry, we exited through the mouth accidentally. <laughs> Gotta go through the nipple gate. Knock, knock. Hello? Oh, we just- okay. I thought we were supposed to grab a tooth. Alright, time to throw this hard in here, I guess. Keep it fresh. Okay, James. You're gonna have some weird stuff in your house. James? Alright. You do you, James. Okay, so what else are we doing here? Gonna continue with the, the nipple gate? What else do I have to do? Can I... Stop showing me the nips, man. Okay. Am I missing something here? Let's see. So... We got- Oh, we're just supposed to click on it. Okay. All right, that was, I was not expecting that, but okay. All right, I guess let's just start off with this branch. Aw, summer 1865, finding love. Oh, look at James and Mary here. Well, what a beautiful sunset. Mary's like, I, I want to look at James, but like, I can't because then he'll know that I'm looking at him. She's like, is, is he really the one? Uh, James, we got to think of a better pickup car for you. Oh, okay. Hanky. All right. I, I guess we got to give her this rose somehow. All right. No worry, James. I got your back. Mr. Raven's got your back, too. He's apparently... Oh, okay, I grabbed a feather, but I wanted this key, actually. Okay, do you want this hanky? I'll trade ya. What about... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Oh, oh, do you want this rose? I'll trade ya. You won't... Okay, fine, fine. Well, uh, James, um... Why don't you use this feather to write something? Do I, do I draw a heart? <laughs> All right. Well, we'll let you think about it. Um, Mr. Crow. Something about the branches. Oh, do I give James the rose? James, take this rose and give it to her, will you? Or should I give her the rose? <laughs> James, I am, I am picking up your girl here, man. Oh, oh no, what on earth? I didn't, okay, give her the hanky. Give her the hanky, James. Take the hanky. Here, madam. Oh, why? I just collected this woman's blood. Okay, uh, Miss Raven, is this what you wanted? <laughs> He's like, <laughs> no, no, <laughs> that's weird. Yeah, that is pretty darn weird. All right. Oh, you need it for ink. How could I not remember this? Very similar from the first game, too. All right, dab it. <laughs> so disturbing. Wow. Everyone, if someone came up to you, gave you this letter, and it says something romantic, like, will you marry me? And you go, what is this, what is this red stain up here? <laughs> and they go, it's from your blood. I I don't even know what you know, I I don't even know what I do. But Mary here, she's gonna she's gonna fall in love. Mary, take this card and fall in love with James. <laughs> hmm. She's like, I like a bad boy. <laughs> James is like, I know. And, oh, she was hiding a worm. Gosh, dang it, Mary. You just moved over a foot. Could have uh, given Mr. Raven here what he wanted. All right, now what is in here? What are we trying to open? Ah, yes. <laughs> His grandmother's uh, ring. Um, Kept pretty fresh, actually. All right, James, do your thing. 
Well, does she say yes? Yep. He he hit her hard in the heart. You did it, boy. Uh, I mean, you did it, man. <laughs> Wow, that was one of the most interesting proposals I have ever seen in my life. And I get to experience it with you all. Alright, what is the next one here? Summer, 1870. The Staircase. Okay, okay. Ah, yes. Throwback to Rusty Lake Hotel. Alright, what's on here? We got some shapes. Some nice shapes. Okay, we'll come back to that. We got a window. Something's gonna appear in this window. No? Okay, I'm surprised. All right. Um, we all know who these characters are. Oh, you can move them. Okay. It's gotta move in order, I guess. Uh-huh. Okay. Cool, let's look back at this. So... This, what is, what is that? Okay, so there's that little thing right there, okay. So, triangle, triangle, moon, okay. So try, sorry, sorry, sorry. Triangle, okay. Triangle, triangle, moon, and then the rest are just dots. Do, 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 do. Reminds me of the nipple gate. Is that it? I thought that was it. Corners and then the moon. Corners and then the moon. Huh. I thought that was the uh, the answer. Alright, I guess we'll come back to that? Oh, what is... Okay. So we gotta... Put all the pieces together? Alright, guess I'll come back to that. Although, I thought I got this one right. Hmm. Let's see what James thinks about this. James, what are you thinking? Oh, there's a different code. Spring 1859. My brother, oh, <clears throat> my brother and I are in the final stage of finding the elixir, the alchemist. Okay, so we gotta change it to this instead, okay. Oh, this is different than a dot. Oh, okay. Oh, I see. Do we have to find all the missing pieces to what all of them are? So the middle one is the moon. Okay, so middle's the moon, and these two are the dots. So we just need to figure out what this one, this one, and this one are. Um, okay. Oh, Mary and James, little, little bow right there. Okay, and I guess the rest of it is triangle, triangle, moon. Okay. So triangle, triangle, moon. Is that it? Nice. Binoculars. Let's look out that window. Hmm. That hotel looks very, very, very familiar. Wait a second. Is this back in the past? Because it doesn't look so rusty anymore. Hmm. The windows, they're having a rave in there for one thing. I did not see that in the previous game. Okay, well, I got some binoculars. Uh, and I don't know what to do now. Do we... James, what are you thinking? I don't know what that is, James. Is that a door? A doorway or some? Maybe... Maybe I'm supposed to look outside, and this is supposed to tell me something to do with the bookcase here? But I don't remember. And I'm supposed to be moving this along too? Is this the beginning? Then where's the end? This is the end. Okay. 
this is the beginning. Uh, where is it like that? Um, something that fits there. You just need one, so maybe like that. Oh, oh, it's three of them. Cool. Okay. Oh, goodness. Um, I, is this supposed to be the order that we took care of each animal? Because I'm going to be honest, I, I don't remember. It's been a while. So he, the raven's definitely last. Uh, who was the last one? The boar was last, I remember. The pigeon was there Mr. Rabbit was first and or was she switched with her oh no 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 it was Mr. Antler dude first it was him pretty sure he, we went with him first Boar was definitely last uh, of the five the crow was definitely last and I'm trying to remember what the order of these three were was she second and she I think the pigeon was definitely right before the boar. Wait, or was it the... <laughs> I can't remember. Or was it the rabbit? Oh, dang. I honestly don't remember. Um, hold on. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to look back at my, my previous video here. If anyone's interested, I uh, linked my playlist to Rusty Lake Hotel in the description below. But hold on. Let me go back and actually look at this because I I don't remember. Alright, so apparently it was Rabbit. So I'm looking at my thumbnails here because I, I made the thumbnails very specific to what animals were uh, taken care of in each episode. So the first one was the Rabbit. So the Rabbit was, was I guess, the Rabbit and the Deer. So it must have been this. And then... The pea or the pheasant and the pigeon and the boar was next. So I thought this was how I went down. Unless I switched these two. No. It wasn't that. Okay, let me switch these two. And then these two. I was pretty sure the boar was last. He was definitely first. Maybe that's not, it's not supposed to be the order which you do them in? Hmm. I don't know then. All right, we'll go back to that. All right, let's take a look at this. Um, hmm. So I guess these were just trying to Oh, maybe I have to match color as well. So, well, first off, we know that these two go together. Uh, these two go together. This and this go together here. But the red needs to go over here. The book needs to match with that. The book can go here. And then this has to go here. Uh, and this can go here. Oh. And then we got this guy. He can go... Huh. I guess it has to be like this. And then we need a, another brown. Oh, which means that he must go all the way in the end. Because there's no other brown here. Oh man, move everything? Okay. So like this, the red has to go here, which means the S goes here. Um, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. But the red is here, so that's problematic. Um, unless we put this in the middle. Nice. All right. Um. Hmm. I still don't know what I'm missing 
from this though. So deer, rabbit, maybe in alphabetical order? So D, R, pigeon, pheasant, um, boar, I guess is B, and then raven would be last. So B, D, R, oh, R, oh, rabbit, raven. Well, that's, that's an alphabetical order, but that doesn't seem to be the case here. Boar, deer, pheasant, pigeon, rabbit, raven. Huh. Okay. Well, raven was last. I definitely think he was first. I thought boar was right before, so it's a mixture of these three. Was something like this. Huh. Is there supposed to be a clue here? Like, is, is this supposed to tell us some answers by looking? Oh! I didn't know I was supposed to double click! Well, thank goodness. Okay, so rabbit... Um, rabbit, pigeon, I guess the pheasant's in the middle, but where's the antler? Oh, 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 it's have to look through each window. Okay, so it's deer, pheasant. Wow, this is so dumb. I'm sorry, everyone. Totally missed on that. Okay, so uh, let's see. Rabbit, pigeon, um, boar, raven. So rabbit, pigeon, boar, raven, and then deer, pheasant. Okay. Okay, so let's do deer, pheasant, ray. Oh, okay. <laughs> nice. Oh, this is what James was thinking of. James, this is what you were thinking of. Well, I opened it for you, good sir. Now let's go downstairs. Nice. All right. Okay, so are these the chapters? So I'm on five out of 33. So what was this here? Okay. Well, I guess I should go to this one. Oh, childbirth. Okay. All right, everyone. I think I am going to stop here for today. Um, I am really liking this game so far, actually. It's, um, it's very much more linear, to me at least, than Rusty Lake Hotel, how they set up their puzzles. And, uh, it's- but I still love the weirdness and the randomness <laughs> of the Rusty Lake series. Alright everyone, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Until then, bye!